evening guys. <laughs> welcome to G-Site Lines and welcome to Scotland. Long drive up yesterday, so I'm currently in Ayrshire on a beach somewhere. I don't really know. I know there's a golf course behind me. Other than that, I don't know. So I've got with me John. How you doing? Hello. Right, Hi everybody. Hi guys. My mate Steve. Steve and John are both real supporters and of the channel, but also very supportive of me and my endeavour to bring fishing to the world, shall we say. So, believe it or not, I'm actually bait fishing. Um, I've dragged the stuff out, it's make or break for me. Um, we're targeting flounder and bass tonight. Um, the sun's still quite high, low tide is just verging on being at its lowest point, I reckon. Um, and the theory is, is once the sun starts to drop, the fish might come on. Um, guys have been telling me tales of decent sized flounder and bass that have come out of this mark on rag and lug. So I've got two rods out, um, one on an up and over rig with a big chunky lug bait on and a click down flapper rig with rag on. So we'll see how that gets on. What are you fishing on John? Yeah, I've, well, <laughs> I've backed into one. I've got a four hooks flapper it, um, one with crab, one hooks crab, two hooks a lug and one hook a rag. Um, and I did have a rag and um, crab bait out and a lug rig, but it's that's just on the horizon. Yeah, it's on the horizon. Yeah, it's on the horizon yeah, well, <laughs> that went sailing. <laughs> And then Stevie boy, just a couple of two hook flappers on each rig, uh, one both, one with rag, one with lug on either. So, so we'll see, see how it goes. Yeah. Do you like his hat, by the way? Yeah. So he told you they're loyal. John's got his hoodie, but it's too, it's too warm for them. Yeah. I've had to go back to the car and get me waders because the summer softie is freezing. I'm not now because we've just lumped all our stuff up. But anyway, guys, we're gonna I'm gonna get the second rod out. There's the rods. There's the setup. I'm going to get the second rod out and then hopefully we'll start getting some taps soon. Guys, thanks for joining us. Stay safe. Tight lines. Tight lines, gents. Cheers. Cheers. Chris been stood here having a bit of a yarn, putting the world to rights. And then out of the corner of John's eye, just scoop the sand. And this little piece popped up. Under my foot. Under his foot, quite literally. So, guess what's going on the hook? Imminently, but that's a really good sign. If these are here, there's oh, right. every chance once this starts to flood, the bass will start coming in if he stays upright. Yeah, but yeah, good sign. So it's not a blank tonight, it's not a blank. <laughs> we're we're effect effectively caught a fish. Well, I say we, that's the royal we. I'm taking some credit <laughs> for being stood there. But anyway, nice one, mate. Fish on, happy with that, eh? <laughs> yeah. Free right. bait, free bait, hopefully, bass on the end of it very soon. <laughs> See you in a bit guys, tight lines. <laughs> Folks, so we've just had a rebate. We've been fishing, what do you reckon Steve? About an hour and a half, two hours yeah. ish. About, yeah. yeah, about that. Um so we've some pretty of us have. Yeah, some of us have. Some of us have been wandering back to the car to get waders. Um We've pretty much all just rebated. Um this rod is I've waded out chest deep and hoofed it because there's mad there is a method behind the madness. There was birds working in that area, so we know there's sand deal here. So if they're getting a hit from above, there's a good chance they get hit from below as well. And then this one, just from the shoreline, just giving it a 20, 30 yard cast because we are on the flood now, and hopefully the flounder will start moving in. That's... What's that, Steve? John? <laughs> I'm not saying a word. I'm not saying a word. Anyway, guys. Sun's starting to set, the wind's dropped, it's a beautiful evening, we're having a good laugh and good company, and all we need now is our fish. We've had a sand deal, just need our fish. And I've just noticed you're not very clean. How's that? Is that better? All the muck gone, and again. There we go, all the muck's gone. Guys, we'll see you in a bit. Peace. Right, folks, we're starting to get a little bit excited now because the tide is really pushing in and we've moved the rods back probably four times in the last 10 minutes. The birds out there, are going bonkers, um, the lights dropping. We're all getting a little bit excited that the fish will be on soon. And as we were talking, Stevie's little rod here has been talking away. So we're just going, he reckons it's crabs. Let's have a look. Nothing? Oh, 
Beautiful spot though. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it looks like the witching hour potentially is upon us. So we've just been stood here again having a yarn and my left rod gave an absolute thump of a hit. Um, the birds have moved off but the tide is really pushing in now and as you can tell the lights dropped, the sun sunk so we're really optimistic that in the next half an hour 40 minutes we're going to start to produce some fish. Believe it or not it's actually gone 10 o'clock at night. Um, I know for a fact in Cornwall it'll be dark already so um, yeah we're, we're quite optimistic now but there will be a fish very soon so I'm just keeping an eye on my rods yeah we'll come back to you guys if we get some action cheers okay, it's witching hour oh no is it gone you lost it oh mate it's gone to mine isn't it it's dropped yours and it's going to mine that well, was definitely connected. Yeah. Good club. Disappointing. Well, we're starting to get some signs now. First rod. Tapped a few times while I was moving my seat box up from the tide. It's gone back and there's two really good knocks again, aren't there? That was definitely a flatty rattle, wasn't it? Yeah. There you go. One more, come on. That's on the flat one. You got a fish? <laughs> oh, what is that? Hey! Well done, mate. That was the slight lane. That was the slack line. I noticed the slack line as well. There we go. Look at that. Brilliant. Get on, mate. Nice little flounder. And in the meantime, well done, Stevie. First fish of the night. That's not a sand hill. Fry in the water, or was that shrimp? Shrimp. Shrimp. I think that's what I tried before the bar. Yeah. Right, one down. Well done, mate. <laughs> the skunk is off the board. Right, come on, fish. Let's get you rattling on this again. Yeah, I'm going to give it a give it a check. It's bigger as well. Hey, look. Brilliant, well done, mate. In, hook lipped it. Yeah, it's hooked. a bit deeper this time. Yeah. T bar job. Well done, mate. There's a T bar on top of my box if you need it. Yes. That's a bit of Yeah, getting bigger, aren't they? Yeah. Didn't even know we had it on. Yeah, T bar. T bar. Right, I'll let you get on and on hook that, mate, and I'll um, keep watching my rods. <laughs> well done, Stevie. <laughs> right, guys, I don't know how much you can see us because the light's awful, but Stevie, John, thanks for a fantastic night. Hey, what is it? Well done on your flounders, Stevie. Happy? Yep. Um, a few more fish would have been nice, wouldn't it? Yeah, definitely. But definitely. we've scouted out the mark, and um, I think you've got a better idea of fishing it for the future, haven't you? 
But then you've done alright in the past, though. I've done alright, yeah. yeah. It's yeah. just early in the year, isn't it? It's, yeah. still, it's been cold. The water temperatures are down a lot more yeah. than they usually are. And then all of a sudden you had this spell of good weather. Yeah, the I'd weather's... I'd still brought... say we're a good, maybe, two or three weeks behind. Yeah. Where we should be. Um, you know, like, coming, like, June time, we'd be thinking, yeah. Aye, now we're on. Yeah, pretty much. We should be hitting the, the bass and the flounders and... Yeah. Well, good luck with you guys for the rest of the season. Yep. Um, thanks for having me. Cheers. No doubt. I don't know if I'll see John later on in the week. Uh, I'm sure, yeah, but I'll yeah, maybe, possibly not. But Stevie and I will definitely be doing I'll something down on the pier. Yep. For definite. So, guys, thanks for joining us. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you like this video. If you do, please give it a thumbs up, comment, and if you haven't, please consider subscribing. And we'll see you probably on air pier next time. Guys, stay safe. Thanks very much, gents. Thanks. Tight Cheers. Thank you. All the best.